Hello YouTube, it's Robert at Robert's Acrylic Pores today. I want to explain some acrylics that I just purchased. I've got some ultramarine blue, a violet, Mars black, phthalo blue, chrome orange, bright red, as well as fire red, chrome yellow, emerald green, golden yellow, burnt umber, uh, titanium white, white, magenta green, red, Violet, black, brown, peach. Um, this is going to be a turquoise blue with a blue, yellow, and an orange. So I've got good, beautiful primary colors and nice metallic colors. Gold. Um, this is a Aztec gold. i got a silver, copper, as well as bronze, and antique gold. And then I've got here, same thing basically over here, it's just bigger bottles. And then behind I've got some festival colors that's from uh, Mr. Wally World from Walmart. Um, they are the festival, it's folk art, and then I've also got Apple Barrel. Also I use Liquitex, Liquitex Basics as well. That's a 48 pack. Um, and also I just got in some neon colors. We've got a neon blue. This is Sash True Flow Heavy Body Acrylic. Same thing as this here. And the Crayola is not heavy body, it's just the regular paint. So I don't think that, I don't think I will have to do as much Floatron in the Crayola as I will the Sash uh, Heavy Body Acrylic because it doesn't have so much. Yeah, it's not as thick. I'll get it out in a second. But where this is. So this where I'll have to use it is in the heavy body acrylic. But that's the neon blue. Then I got the neon orange. Same thing. Uh, the pink. Same heavy body acrylic. Same thing. Neon pink. I've also got the neon red with by Saks. Neon green by Saks. Uh, heavy body acrylic. Um, neon green and heavy body acrylic neon yellow by Saks. These are um, good paints. I had never used some neon colors. I really had never used that paint, but I'm sure it's gonna be nice and beautiful anyway because I love acrylic paints. Um, and I'm sure the acrylic pores that I'm going to do is going to be nice. The ones I have now, I've used the acrylic here, and this is just regular acrylic paint from like the Hobby Lobby. And this is like nine dollars a little container. Eight nine dollar. Well, yeah, six, seven, eight, nine, and you know it just ranges. But it's better to buy it like this because it's cheaper, in other words. But that's uh, what I want to explain about that. And these are some of the sixteen by twenties that I come out with, having that kind of work. This is teal, blue, white, and gold and silver together. This is black, orange, and white. And with those colors, it means it's turned into a brownish color. And some more black was still left behind. And on this 16 by 20, I've got red, pink, and white mixed together. I did that for Valentine's Day. I thought that turned out really nice. Um, um, that's about it for the uh, photos right now. I've got plenty of more boy minutes, just an example. Um, but until then, I'll talk with you guys later. I hope everybody's having a great weekend. Till next time, you too. Bye.